I'm currently studying for a Masters in Materials Engineering. I've always had an interest in the aerospace industry and in our course we studied the materials in gas turbine engines and that's what led me to apply to Rolls-Royce and end up working here. My department was very helpful in giving us information on what companies offer placements and what sort of work you can get into. Uh, they also had sessions on interview techniques and how to apply for the placements. As a member of the Loughborough University Liaison Team, I'm a point of contact for the Materials Department and as a, an assessor, I will interview students applying for graduates or placement schemes. If an application meets our requirements, a student will be invited to an assessment centre where they will undertake an interview. I've been working as a manufacturing engineer uh, in a facility in the turbines division of Rolls-Royce. The technologies and the engineering are extremely advanced here. It's really fascinating and the fact it's not the same every day is what I found most enjoyable. Adam has been part of our programme now for the past 12 months and during his placement he's become a real important part of the team. He's got real responsibility within the team for certain projects and programmes and Adam's monitoring and performance is the same as any other Rolls-Royce employee and we give him set objectives and tasks to deliver which Adam works on. I'm a member of a new facility creation team, so as part of that I've been designing and writing the requirements for the new pieces of machinery which will be going into that facility. I've also been involved in several improvement projects on the current processes. I've learned several skills which can help you in everyday jobs, for example communication skills, uh, being able to plan your work is obviously a very important one. I've also learned if I decided to come back to Rolls-Royce quite a lot of the skills associated within the company in this particular type of component as well. So if I did decide to come back that would benefit me in the future. I've had very good experience with the students from other universities and especially with Adam from Loughborough. They bring a real fresh pair of eyes to programmes, a real drive and real enthusiasm for getting to know what goes on and it's really really refreshing to have them as part of our team. On my placement I've had a tutor from my department who is one of the full-time lecturers so if there's any issues that I have uh, from the university point of view she can help with that. She's visited three times in the final visit there's an oral presentation that I have to give which is to her and also some of my work colleagues. The performance of a student is monitored by their appointed line manager. At the end of their placement they'll be reviewed with their line manager and someone from our human resources department will sit down with the student to review their performance and overall progress. The fact I've done a placement I think will definitely help me when I return to Loughborough. I haven't been based in a direct materials job but I think from that I've gained a broad understanding of engineering as a whole and where materials fits in with other disciplines and I think that will definitely help me when I go back. If successful during their placement, a student may be offered a place on our graduate scheme or invited back to one of our assessment centres. Our engineering graduate scheme approximately takes on 170 students every year in the UK. We expect this number to increase, however, over the 2013 period. When I finish my placement, I'll have a meeting with one of the Rolls-Royce careers advisors and it's in that when we discuss any potential opportunities within the company, whether if I would like to stay, uh, one thing they're quite keen on is to encourage people to stay on and agree before their final year as this will help me mainly as I don't have to worry about the stress of applying for a job when I'm facing my final exams.